Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. Mike here at Weeby Autos. Today we have a 1949 Mercury Meteor. You don't really see these around. Uh, a lot of custom touches have been done to this car, if you notice. Uh, custom purple paint. The white was just also added with some flake in it. Custom bumper up front. Got the indicators uh, Frenched in to the bumper. Custom headlights as well. The hood's been nosed. Polara hubcaps, uh, lake pipes, bubble skirts, very correct for the year. Dual exhaust, French in antenna, chrome hinges. These tail lights might be LED. It's gonna turn them on. You can see the flake in the white here. Looks pretty cool. Very period. Door poppers, uh, trunk popper. The handles have been shaved, as you can see. Custom steering wheel, with tilt column. Seat belts all the way around. We've got a 350 under the hood. Power steering, power brakes, and vintage air. Also metal flake or metallic in the paint as well. Pretty cool uh, door popper under here. That pops the driver door. See that popped open. Pretty cool. Custom pinstriping. A spare in the trunk. There's also a popper here for the door. So if you notice, there's no interior door handle. So that pops open. Cadillac poles. Almost looks like a Cadillac interior. Really nice two tone with piping and an armrest. Very, very comfortable. Let's see if that. Yeah, those are LED. Nice and bright. So I have a license plate light. Up front we got custom headlights too. Nice and bright. We got the running lights and the indicators in the bumper it looks like. Yeah, pretty cool. Never seen that done before, but that makes sense. Nicely Frenched in. Real nice fitment of all the panels too. Dakota Digital Gauges, showing 15,149 miles. Custom leather wrapped steering wheel. Looks like a Grant steering wheel possibly. Vintage Air, custom Clarion stereo. We got Clarion speakers in the back. 12 volt adapter, custom RPM gauge. Dakota Digital Clock. This is a popper for this door. Pops right open. Cool. Custom headliner as well. Very clean. Nice build. Firing on 659s back there with the third brake light. It's got a hood pole too, which is pretty cool. These cars did not come with that. Also a uh, popper for the trunk. Spare tire. A custom horn down there as well. All programmable switches and everything. Power windows. Nice, comfortable car. Under the hood, we got a 350. Power steering, power brakes, Edelbrock 600 carburetor, vintage air conditioning, 
chrome alternator. Runs really nice. Comes the radiator as well. Wheel end intake. Blocks also a painted purple to match. Real nice, reliable cruiser. The owner drives this car everywhere. Brand new wide whites as well. Well, guys, thanks for joining us today. Again, my name is Mike from Weeby Autos. Uh, feel free to give me a call. I'm at 631-339-0399. You can also check out more pictures, information, and detail on our main website, so weebyautos.com. And uh, thanks for joining me today.